Hey everybody, my name is Jeremiah Craig and today I am at Rick Walker's in Boston, Massachusetts and we're checking out these Corel Roper boots, Cayman Belly. Let's get into it. All right, so today I stopped into Rick Walker's here in Boston, Massachusetts because I really wanted to see all of the different kinds of boots they have here. Now, unlike some other places I've been in Boston, this place sells both vintage boots and new boots. So it's a really cool place to be. It feels like you're sort of stepping back in time with some of these boots. I absolutely love just perusing around here and looking at all the different styles. But when it came down to it, my eye really settled on these Corel Cayman Belly boots. It's just something about Cayman, guys. It's always drawing my eye. I love the look of Cayman Belly. It's my favorite exotic. And in this honey color is what they're calling it, it just looks spectacular. Now, I haven't done a review of a Corel men's boot yet, so I also wanted to take the opportunity to do that. So let's sort of run over this boot and, and break down the qualities of it and everything. First thing that stands out is the beautiful honey color Cayman belly. I absolutely love this color. In fact, this is a color that is really drawing my interest recently. Uh, the tan, the honeys, the cognacs, like I love that lighter brown look, especially with the texture of Cayman belly. I also really like the toe of this. It's a nice round toe, kind of like a U-toe with a single stitched welt, and it is all the way around. So this is a full welt. You're not going to see any pegs or brass nails in this boot. Also, we have a stacked leather heel. It is a shorter boot. Uh, it looks like it's probably 11 inches tall, and the shaft is very, very supple. It also has really nice leather lining. There's an extra leather lining sewed in and they've gotten rid of the bulky seam, which I always like to see on the inside here where they stitch the seams together on the shaft. They've also done that on the lining the other way around. So that's not gonna give you any irritation in there at all. And it also is just a really nice touch, especially to an, an exotic boot. Another thing we have in here is a leather insole. It's a cushioned leather insole, so it's a leather on top, and then you have some foam in there. They call it their extra comfort insole. There's double cushions in there, and apparently it's new comfort technology, which is pretty much on par with what every boot company says about their insole. <laughs> I really like the colors of this. It looks great. I think it's finally time to try this boot on. All right, here. Oh, like that sound. This is a nice fit. This is a great fit. Whew, they look incredible, too. This is a great fitting Cayman boot. It's nice and snug right at the widest part of my foot, and I still got a good amount of heel slip. Man, Cayman is a... A tougher leather like it's a little bit stiffer um, but it's just something about it feels really nice I love the fact that it it feels just a little bit more sturdy and it has the look that it does I mean Cayman belly or Cayman tail just looks plain badass I mean you can't argue with that look it looks great and I love the round toe on it with the lower heel it feels really nice the broader walking type style heel is great and that cushion insole does actually give me a good amount of support at the arch which I wasn't expecting because you guys know that I am a narrow width I'm a 12b and yet the 11d on this boot right now is working perfectly uh, I would I was just about to say I I want to buy this boot, but when you when you put on Cayman, that's always a dangerous move because they do come with higher price tags. This 
Cayman Belly Corral boot is coming in at around $400 and it is worth it for real. I remember the first time I tried Cayman on, it was at Davis Trailer World. It's the French toe boule Caymans that you guys have seen me wear around. The first time I put that boot on, I bought it. Like Cayman is dangerous for me. I don't even know why. I, I mean, every time I put on a Cayman boot, why do I do this to myself? Why do I do this myself? <laughs> this is a great fitting boot and it feels great too. Wow. Not only that, it just looks spectacular. Love the color of it. All right, wrapping up my thoughts here about this Corral Cayman Belly Roper. Now this is a Stockman heel. I don't know if I mentioned it before. It's a little bit higher than a Roper heel, but it does have sort of the Roper feel to it. I mean, this is probably one and a quarter inch. A lot of Ropers um, will also have just a one inch heel. This is just a little bit higher, but it wears very much like a Roper. It feels great. It has the short height of it. It has that round toe. It just looks spectacular. Corral did a great job with this. Um, I, I like everything about this boot and it's coming in at $399.50, uh, which is a very reasonable price for Cayman, especially one that feels like this. If you're interested in this boot, you can go to rickwalkers.com and just ask them about this or a lot of the other boots that they have. They have a bunch of cool stuff here. So let me know what you guys think of this Corel Cayman Belly boot down in the comments. Thank you so much for watching today and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time. Peace. Don't you just love a boot that you can feel great in? That's why I like these Corel Caymans. Keeping it classy all the way till day's end. Always transcending all the trends. Hey, 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 hey. All right. My name is Jeremiah Craig. Thank you for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe. I got more boot videos coming at you at least two every week now. Yeah. I'll see you next time.